viewers all over the world, we are here again with the Prophet of God, the Prophet E.G. Swanda, who has been a professor in international prophecies and with over 15 confirmed prophecies. We thank you for being with us again on this edition, Men of God. It is a pleasure. Thank you so much. Uh, we are here today to speak to him about a prophecy that he gave in line with the nation of Mozambique about a cyclone that was named Cyclone Chineso later as it happened. And it hit specific places in Vilamkuli, uh, Neva Mamboni, and the Beira. So, men of God, is it in the will of God for such things to happen? No, it was not in the will of God. That was not in the will of God. Uh, that's the reason why I came out to, to forewarn people who were in the places that uh, were hit specifically, that they are supposed to vacate that area uh, so that they can be protected from what was supposed to, from this uh, cyclone that was coming. Yes. Uh, so instructions are very important when it comes to men of God. Uh, so could you not pray and stop this men of God? Uh, what I can say is uh, when God speaks, sometimes you have to follow what the instruction that you have given you. When he reveals something and he says, pray about this, you can pray and you stop it. And when he says, go and tell people to move, this is coming. I'm not supposed to pray there. My, my duty as a prophet is to take the message to the people as it is. They are supposed to vacate the area. Cheneso is coming. So, men of God, how do you then deal with these things that are out of the will of God that are happening in the world? You know, for the past 20 years, I've been having a problem uh, with people who are responsible for certain, in certain areas. You know, when God speaks sometimes, you know, uh, you try to speak or address the issue directly trying to contact the person who is responsible, who can make a change or a decision to help people. And I've been having a problem with people who don't take prophetic messages seriously. And people don't listen. People don't listen. That's why some a lot of things that have happened, uh, bad things that have happened, have happened. You know, as I'm telling you, for the past 20 years, people have been resisting the prophecies that have been given to them individually, people who are in places of power. So you see, people of God, uh, things that are out of the will of God can actually happen. And uh, if you don't heed the prophetic words, they are for surely impact impacts and implications of not listening uh, to prophetic words. That's very true. Recently, I, I prophesied about uh, the, the, the nation of China, of what they are doing, and I said God is, a, is going to judge the nation of China. I, I saw an earthquake hitting that nation uh, after they've not done anything in line with what I specifically stated in the prophecy. And that's exactly that's what's going to happen if they don't obey the prophetic message. Thank you, men of God. Uh, although it's a said not, but uh, we hope those that are in power will listen. Uh, thank you, viewers all over the world, for being with us. You can get in touch with us on, on the details on our screen, or you can also get in touch with us on all of the social media platforms all over. Thank you.